We then that are strong ought to bear the infirmities of the weak, not to plead ourselves. Let every one of us please his neighbor for his good to edification. For even Christ pleased not himself. As it is written, the reproaches of them reproached thee fell on me. Whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning, that we, through patience and comfort of the scriptures, might have hope. Now the God of patience and consolation grant you to be like-minded one toward another according to Christ Jesus, that ye may with one mind and one mouth glorify God, even the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. Wherefore, receive ye one another, as Christ also received us for the glory of God. Now I say that Jesus Christ was a minister of the circumcision for the truth of God, to confirm the promises made unto the fathers. Gentiles might glorify God for his mercy, as it is written, for this cause, will confess to thee among the Gentiles, sing unto thy name. And again he saith, Rejoice ye Gentiles with his people. And again, Praise the Lord, all ye Gentiles, and Lord him, all ye people. And again, Isaiah saith, There shall be a root of Jesse, and he that shall rise to reign over the Gentiles in him shall the Gentiles trust. Now the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing that ye may abound in hope through the power of the Holy Ghost. And I myself also am persuaded of you, my brethren, ye also are full of goodness, filled with all knowledge, able also to admonish one another. Nevertheless, brethren, I have written the more boldly unto you in some sort, as putting you in mind because of the grace that is given to me of God. I should be the minister of Jesus Christ to the Gentiles, ministering the gospel of God, that the offering up of the Gentiles might be acceptable, being sanctified by the Holy Ghost. Hello everyone and welcome to Cloud9 Blessings. This is Amber and I hope that you are all having a very beautiful and blessed week. Thank you so much for joining me here on the channel. The rapture dream I am about to share with you today was emailed in by our dear sister in Christ, Melissa, where she shares with us her rapture dream and seeing angels taking the believers to heaven. I am now going to read to you Melissa's email in her exact words, and it says, Hello, my name is Melissa, and I have a rapture dream that I would like to share with you that I received in January of 2021. I had woke up in the middle of the night and had immediately woken my husband to explain my dream. I had also decided to call my sister to tell her about my dream because it seemed so intense and I wanted to let them know every little detail about this dream right away. In my dream, it was me and my family members and it was nighttime and we had just came out of the movie theater and were walking to the parking lot. As we looked up, we saw the moon and it was very full. It was also white and had a bit of yellow color to it and was bright where it gave its light. I remember looking up to the night sky and told everyone to look up because I could see a large group of angels from far away flying together. The angels wings were huge with a bunch of white feathers flying between the moon and the clouds and next thing you know an angel had come so quickly down and began to lift me up with his wings wrapped around me where I could not see my surroundings or beneath me. I felt like I was wrapped in a blanket. I had felt safe and secure as I was going up. I remember thinking and saying to myself, I cannot believe that this is happening. This is so real. Next thing I remember is being taken to this place that had green carpet and stools. The stools were ready for each person. Then I remember seeing a male person, but I'm not sure who he was, and he told me to lean my head forward because they were going to turn a knob to release water, like a baptism. Then I remember seeing three of my sisters, and they were asking where their kids were, but the angels were still picking people up.
After having this dream, later that morning, I had turned my phone on and this video appeared and so I was very curious and clicked on it. And it was this music artist and video that I had never heard of was with Jason Upton, Fly. When I had watched this video, it had brought tears to my eyes because I know God was speaking to me and the song seemed to match my dream. Thank you so much, Cloud9 Blessings, for taking your time to read, share, and to make these dreams come alive to help wake people up and make a difference in people's lives. I deeply appreciate this. God bless you. Have a great day. Thank you so much, Melissa, for sending in this very uplifting rapture dream. It is so encouraging, and I'm sure it will encourage a lot of people out there to continue looking up for our redemption draweth an eye. The rapture is fast approaching and it is imminent. It could happen at any moment. So let us put on our full armor of God and be in the word and looking up. Thank you so much, brothers and sisters, for taking the time to view this video today. I also want to thank each and every one of you for liking, sharing, and subscribing to the channel because constant will continue to be added to this channel weekly. Thank you all so much and God bless.